All right, so we want to find the indicated summation of from n equals 1 up to 6 for n times cosine of n pi. So starting off, we're going to start off with n equals 1. So we get 1 times cosine of 1 times pi plus 2 times cosine of 2 times pi plus 3. And then it's just going to continue going like this all the way up until we hit 6 pi. Or excuse me, just 6. Oops. Getting ahead of myself. Will I be able to get everything on here? I don't know. And plus, I'll just put it down here. Okay, so a lot of these are either um, halfway around the circle or coterminal. So this is the same thing as just cosine of pi. Uh, pi, when it's when it's pi, or excuse me, when cosine is pi, it's, let me draw a unit circle. So here's a unit circle. Here's zero and two pi. And then here's pi. So this ends up being negative one because it's a cosine of pi plus two times two cosine two pi. Two pi is once around, so it's cosine of zero, which is equal to one times two, which is two, plus three pi, so three times negative one. So it's negative three plus four pi. So this ends up being four because it's two times around the unit circle. So again, it's cosine of zero, which is equal to one. And the reason it's equal to one is because the cosine uh, if you ever, cosine is equal to x over r, or the hypotenuse, and x, when the when it's down here, the hypotenuse is down here, it's 1 over 1, basically. And that's how you get 1. Um, so 5, so this ends up being minus 5. And then we get plus 6. So this ends up being plus 2, plus 4, plus 6, so that's 10, that's 12. And then minus 1, minus 4. Minus, so that's minus nine. So our final solution is three. So the whole solution, uh, n equals one to six for the summation of n times cosine n pi. Uh, the summation, even though it's an alternating series, is three. All right, I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching. You have a great day.